Hello magical butterflies, this is Xtina with Butterfly Intuition Divine Guidance. I hope this finds you having a magical day, night, or afternoon. If you are new to my channel, welcome. If you are returning, welcome back. Thank you all so much for your likes, shares, comments, subscription to the channel, and for viewing my videos. To book a personal reading, a live session, a program, or to join my Divine Butterfly Membership Group well, Level 1 or Level 2, go to Butterfly Intuition to book to join the link to my website along with my full list of services and all the ways you can connect with me outside of YouTube are in the description box below. So welcome to your Butterfly Message of the Day for Thursday, June 30th, 2022 or whenever you're watching this because my readings are intended to be timeless. Take only what speaks directly to your soul and what doesn't speak directly to your soul, release it and let it fly. So the first card we have is the veil, the future. So what I'm hearing is that the future is unknown, the future is not clear, and the future is not set in stone. And it is because you are not supposed to know what is going to happen. So the veil will be lifted when it's supposed to. Because right now, it's still brewing. That's what the cauldron is showing me. The cauldron is showing me that something is just not ready yet to manifest, but something is brewing. There is forgiveness that needs to be had this could be with someone who has hurt you, someone who could be no longer on this earth, or someone you are in separation from. So I feel this person, if they're still alive, they want to come in and apologize. And if this is someone who has passed away, they are telling you through this card, through this reading, through this white flower, that they're sorry. The jack-o'-lantern is telling you that you are protected, you are secure, you are safe, it is safe for you to love, it is safe for you to move forward, and it is safe for you to chase your dreams. Your ancestors are guiding you on your journey. They have deep love for you and they want you to keep the legacy going for your DNA, your bloodline. And they want you to do things differently and they want you to do things the way you see fit. Or see fit. You have the strength to be able to manifest something new. So the skeleton, I'm just feeling the death card and tarot transformation vibes. And this card is telling you to take the mask off, to not hide in the shadows. And it is time to go for a treat or more tricks. The Skull of Flowers is telling you that you are creating through the ashes, so you are rebuilding, you are rebirthing, and you are having a renewal. There is a deep remembrance of who you once were, especially if you disconnected from that person. By the winter season, which is the months of December through March, you will see why things paused. So you will see by the fall season which is September through December. So this past winter paused something, but by the fall, by September through December, something is gonna happen. There's gonna be a big change in your life because you are weaving your new web and you are trusting your intuition. And by doing that, you are getting rid of energy vampires, and you are no longer allowing your hidden talents to be unseen. Cardinals could be a bird that you see. They could be a sign for you. Your final message for today is happiness is in our hearts and homes. So make home where the heart is. Always come home to love, to light, and to strength. I do hope today's butterfly message of the day has brought you clarity and guidance. If this message resonated, if you like this reading, drop a comment below to claim to let me know. 
please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And if you are subscribed to my channel, thank you so much. Please hit the bell notification so you can be notified when new content is posted on this channel. Have a magical day, night, or afternoon, and I will talk to you tomorrow.